good morning guys um today i don't really have a lot to do so i don't think this vlog is going to be very long i do have some packing i need to do um because i'm going away tonight so that will be fun well for me i don't know about you <laughs> i love packing um i also wanted to film a video <laughs> see just thinking about it, it makes my voice go croaky a video on why i haven't been so active on YouTube but I don't know um, I'm sure this video will go up after that video uh, but it's basically touching on my depression and stuff like that and I don't know if I'm ready to make that video yet so uh, we'll see we'll see how that goes but I can just uh, I just think I'll crumble at the first hurdle if I film it so I don't know how that's going to go down. Um, but yeah, I really don't have much to do today. Like Mum's ill in bed today, so I've got some cleaning to do. Um, which I'm not really going to film because it's not really exciting. And just general housework, I guess. I'm currently just editing vlogs. Um, and YouTube videos and trying to get some sort of, I don't know, something together. <laughs> um, but yeah, I think most of this video is not actually going to be me talking. It'll probably just be like clips of stuff I'm doing, so it'll probably be quite short and sweet. Um, but I'm trying to get back into filming, so yeah, I will see you on the other side. <laughs> Should probably get these towels on the line while well, it's still beautiful and hot outside here you go watch me do laundry <laughs> oh the exciting life I live eh uh, my scratchy sweet This weekend for a long weekend at Sid's grandparents who live in the middle of the countryside um, so I'm just starting to pack some bits I need to find a backpack because I don't really want to take more than a backpack with me because it's only a weekend um, but I'll show you what we're wearing so I have flannel because got to clean your fla fa face face some fuzzy socks and some normal socks in I don't think I'll wear these but I'm taking them in case we're like in the house for like the day or whatever and I just want something on my feet so then again I could probably just wear these so I might only just take one I've got some Jurassic Park pyjamas now I was just going to take a nighty, but I kind of want something a bit more covered up because it's its grandparents um, 
so I wanted to be a little bit more conservative in case I came down for breakfast. I didn't want to be... Yeah. <laughs> My makeup in here. And then I also just have a dress and some tights in case the weather gets nicer. Um, I do need to pack, obviously, underwear. And I'm probably going to put a spare t-shirt on um, for what? Yeah, I think I'd probably take a spare t-shirt because, um, you know, just in case I get, like, food down me because that's bound to happen. But so far, that is what I got. And I'm going to wear these black jeans, which are, like, high-waisted. That wasn't a very good show. Let's go in this little mirror here. I'm going to wear these black jeans, which are high-waisted, but probably not this scruffy t-shirt. I'll probably put something a bit nicer on. I also thought I would just show you what I'm packing makeup wise because I'm not taking a great deal and let's balance this against my leg. And yeah, I thought I'd show you in case you're interested. So I'm taking some face um, SPF and I always get ones which are UV 5 star because that is the important bit. So yeah, that's coming with me because that's probably what I have on my face most of the day. Got some lady stuff in case um an emergency but yeah should be okay i am taking a foundation i'm just taking this um bourgeois city radiance one just in case i feel like i want to wear foundation i'm not wearing foundation today and i don't think i will be wearing foundation but you never know they might turn around and say let's go somewhere and then I go oh maybe I should make more of an effort so I'm going to take a foundation um I've got two mascaras I have my Tarte's um lights camera lashes and then I'm also trying to finish up this uh, Maybelline one so I'm just going to take them both because they both do different things for my eyelashes taking a powder this would be good if it gets hot I like to just powder my face to stop it from like getting sweaty and also um, to set foundation or concealer if I do wear any of that. So I also have somewhere in here uh, my old collection perfection concealer, which is like nearly done. Two brushes. Um, I've got a powder brush because I have been putting a bit of bronzer on my face because it's a bit paler than the rest of me. And a foundation brush in case I do use the foundation. Here's the bronzer I'm currently using. Again, I'm just kind of like trying to use some of these products up and get them out of my life. And it is a really nice bronzer. It was the shade Sun Dipped by MAC. And I think it was last year's summer collection one. I have the balm. Uh, lip gloss and this is in BAM I really like this colour and I think it really suits me so I'm taking that and I also have um, creme, creme cup because this is just my favourite lip shade which is nearly done now that would be a shame to let go of that guy um, and an eyebrow pencil because to be honest I usually fill in my eyebrows put a bit of bronzer on and some mascara and I'm good to go and obviously um, protect my face but I bought you know a couple of bits in case I do decide to make more of an effort and I'm actually gonna put a scrunchie in there as well to tie my hair up at night. I don't think I want to wear or take a bra with me so um, I'm gonna be quite tactful in the sense of what tops I wear um, just so that I don't offend them not that I think that they'll actually get offended anyway if my nipples shine through at any given moment um i am wearing my like calvin klein ugh, sports bra -y thing at the moment so i might just take that as something um but as for like proper bra kind of things i can't be bothered to take one just meh so yeah i need to sort out my skincare because that's, that is important to me, so. And we need to go and find this backpack. Pretty sure. There's 
like an ice cream in here somewhere. Yes. Oh. Hi, Moody. Moody Pooty. This is one of the grumpiest cats of all time. Look at that belly flare. He's just never a happy boy. Actually, that's a lie. He's happy when he gets catnip. Are you? He looks so miserable. Oh, don't bite. See, told you. Moody pooty. <laughs> Okay, I'll let you go back to napping. Even though that's all he ever does is sleep. <laughs> okay, so moving on to skincare. I've got my Sukin, I think that's how you pronounce it, facial moisturiser. I love this stuff. It is so good. Um, so yeah, I'm taking that. Both me and Sydney will be sharing that one. I've got some eye makeup remover in here. This is just a pot it came in and it's all I've got left. Should really decount it into something smaller, but yeah, whatever. I have a deodorant I found in the cupboard. Um, I finished my deodorant and I'm actually just ordered a different, like more organic deodorant. So um, I found this guy. This was my old deodorant that I gave to my mum to try out, but she didn't like it. So I'm just going to finish that up. Toothbrush, toothpaste, cotton pads, hairbrush, and some underwear, and I also found this Pond's um, cold cream, and I've started using it, but it was just in the cupboard of like stuff that isn't getting used and should be used up soon or thrown out so I thought I'd take that if I do end up wearing foundation and I want to remove it then I've got the um, flannel and I can remove use that to remove it so maybe get some use out of that and get rid of it so awesome uh, I'm not taking perfume I don't really care for perfume and the only thing I would generally take with me for my hair is an oil, but I'm actually finished my hair oil, so I don't have any. Um, so I need to find something to put this in so it doesn't get all grubby in my bag. Um, yeah, I think that's all I'm doing for skincare. I still haven't picked top though, so... Yeah. I just, I don't know what I want to wear, you know? My bag is in the washing machine. I it just smelt of like damp and garage, so that is currently being washed. And I am my ice cream. Um, if you guys didn't know, I am currently vegetarian. I've never been vegetarian in my life before, but I have become a vegetarian overnight, more or less. Um, and now I'm starting to cut dairy out as well. Thing is, is like it's hard because I'm not working so I'm not paying for the food bills and so it's not fair of me to ask my parents to spend more money just for my own reasoning um, which does make it complicated but at the same time with my mum having cancer she is supposed to cut back on the amount of dairy she has so we have been switching out our milk to almond milk we've always had um vegan butter anyway because i i'm like mad for butter and i think my dad is too so um we eat through butter like there's no tomorrow so we've always had vegan butter since i can remember because it's it's better for us than than dairy um but yeah, I'm just slowly working my way on cutting things out and swapping, swapping it out and yeah, we'll see. I, I'm, I mean the goal is to become a vegan but um, you know everyone has a different journey so hopefully, hopefully my won't take too long to get there. Uh, but yeah, um, I don't know really what else to tell you.